Good morning. It's Rosalie with Can't Wait to Plan. Okay, so I have a pretty great haul for you today. I've actually never really ordered much from Spellbinders, um, but I did sign up on their mailing list a while back because I think I bought one thing from them back in like April. I can't even remember what I bought, but I think it was some... Um, I don't even know. Anyway, um, so I sign up to the newsletter and, you know, every so I don't even check my email very well. But the other day, um, about a week, no, not a week, I ordered this on September 13th. So that day, for whatever reason, because it was on the top, I saw that they had a, a clearance haul. So I went online and checked it out. Oh my gosh, it was so good. And actually many of these things are still available. Some have sold out, but some are still available. Uh, some of them, they even reduce it lower. And some of them, they um, went up a little bit. So because I guess maybe they're almost out and you know they don't need to get rid of as many of them so any case i'm going to go through a sort of group thing so that way it's easier for you to um to view and i've gotten all the price the original and what i paid for so in case you wanted to check it out and you know i mean the price it doesn't matter that maybe it's not the same as what i paid but just as long as you feel it's still a good deal right so, and then some of these prices are like crazy. You know, there's there's no reason anybody would buy these at these original price. So, you never know. Sometimes people just um, mark things so that the, the sale sounds better. Uh, I know Joanne does that sometimes. So, who knows, right? But I can't imagine that these would be that price originally. So, anyway, um, these are really cute buttons. There's 48 of them. They come in red, white, and blue um or silver and blue with glitter on it and it's called it's called summer burst and they're actually from a company called um fun stampers journey or fsj which i have never heard of i think i might have heard of them but i've never gotten anything from them and i don't even know what they bought what they make i assumed stamps that's why it wasn't never that interesting to me because <laughs> i don't do stamping very much yet at this moment but anyway these were listed for $5.95 they were on clearance for a dollar okay so that's how they came this particular one these one I got because of Halloween they're called toil toil and toil and trouble 48 piece as well and it's uh red they come in three different sizes that's why that's why I like it because they have different size button on them and that way, boy, this thing is doesn't show very well. I don't know. Anyway, um, and it's really cute. It's got glitter as well. Again, $5.95, a dollar. And then these, they come like this. And I took most of them out of the um, packaging for you. But I just wanted to show you that because these things tend to fall out, um, you know, because they're not a, like a, it's the, these bags that sort of, um, you know they kind of have holes so the buttons sometimes come out so they actually put them a did see like this one came out they put them additionally in a um um seal envelope as well which i thought was really good because that you know i'm not going to store store my buttons in these stupid thing man it's like so you have to kind of open them up this way and roll you know like oh my god i'm not going to do that right every time i need these buttons so i probably do what i normally do is I separate them by color but these are so cute they're called journey color button number two and i paid um they're listed for 4.95 because you only got 24 button but these are larger but look how cute the um the flower one is and the hard and this one has like a emboss design to them let me see if i can you know like so it's it's a bit it's a little bit more fancy fancier whatever you call it you see how the the um some of them have the emboss on them this one and this one and so it's it's more expensive i guess to make okay so those were also on clearance for a dollar um then i got this one that's called uh, just celebration and this one is just the silver glitter which i i like and these were expensive i don't know why i got them 
because I would have never paid just half price. So it's five ninety five. I pay three dollars. I would I should have not gotten them. Um, these one are called pop party pop buttons. Twenty four pieces. I don't know exactly what they mean. I have to maybe call the company and see. But I think it does something different than it. It looks it's a lot thicker. And um, I mean, you can use it as is, but I think it's meant to maybe wrap some uh, like something like this. Maybe I I'm not a hundred percent sure, but anyway, um, super cute. And these were, oh man, see like why did I buy them? Four ninety five on sale for three dollars is what I pay for them. I think they went down now. Um, these are the journey uh, color button number number one these are a bit larger than the journey color button number two so you only get 24 pieces then they go from 4.95 to a dollar then i got these which i really like these are wooden button you get 48 pieces they're heart and stars and in different sizes and these were 3.95 on sale for a dollar and then I've always, I've seen uh, some of these use, um, these mini wooden spool um, that people use on their, like, um, that sewing machine people were making, kind of like a paper craft project. It is not something that you use per se in a um, scrapbooking layout, although you could use the, the front of that. The, that die as the um, as a sewing machine but I thought these were cute they can always also be used as a pool as a pool drawers but they're just mini pool and they're just a dollar you get 12 12 of these spool and they're originally list for um, $4.95 as well okay so then I got um, now all the wooden stuff came in this one I really like these are called vagabond chips I don't know at this um I, i'm trying to see if it's this is focus and they come with all these travel wooden small wooden thing like a camera uh, a um a hot air balloon the globe the stamp the jig -a jig that people told me before what it's called but i can't remember um the suitcase the arrow the little thingy and so on and that's that's so cute i love it i like the size you know sometimes the reason I show you because you can't really tell the size when you see them online. But these are these are small, but they're really cute. They're originally listed for seven dollars. I'm gonna instead of say six ninety five, seven dollars, and they were on sale for um, two dollars. So these are approximately about an inch, a little bit smaller than an inch. Most of them in in the width. Um, like that's an inch there and so forth so you can tell what that size is and this was still available I believe I I checked some of them but it was so hard it's just so many I bought uh, these are DIY hoops I really wanted just a small size and maybe the middle size I saw some people doing some crafting with these for paper craft that was so cute you know you can add like um, make cards out of these make di different embellishment even make um, like the, what do you call them christmas ornaments with them and i've never seen them sold anywhere that i i know of people didn't didn't link um stuff when they were showing these so i found these i just got them they were on six dollars on sale for two okay and then now we got to all the metal stuff i got these two brad uh, mini brad set 120 pieces each and they have one is called bright and one is called be sweet and they're four different colors so you get 40 i um, mean the 30 pieces for each and they're just pretty and they were so cheap they were um five dollars on sale for two for these and mini brats i don't have a lot of i have the regular one but i do have some of the mini but not as much so i went ahead and pick it up these two were interesting i couldn't really tell the size um but i just I don't know. I don't know exactly what I was going to do with it. These you can hook up to different two different things on both sides. Um, this I was thinking depends on the size of them and how thick they are. And they are quite thick. So I'm not sure exactly. I think I'm just going to have to use them for project instead of scrapbooking. You could put pictures in them. You could fill it up with resin like this. A lot of different things you can do. But definitely it's a little bit too bulky to use in, in a scrapbook. But definitely for mini albums or things like that's what i was thinking too mini albums you know you can do ribbon through here and do that as a really pretty um 
embellishment in front of an, an album or even as a closure too. Um, so I thought that was cool. And these were normally uh, $10 each. They on sale for a dollar because these are nice, heavy uh, metal. Okay, then I got these um, three, they're like clips. Um, these were copper, copper clips. They're called page huggers and they're super cute on $6 on sale for two. These are thinner paper clip, which I really like. You see how thin they are in terms of, you know, um, so you can add them to, to your pages without being too much. And that's, you get eight of them. Um, same thing with this. This is a little bit thicker, but they're still really cute, I thought. Um, so these were all $4.95, uh, $4.95 on sale for $2, okay? So that's that. And then I got, um, oops, let me move this. Then I got these, um, this busy sign and the cute little butterfly. They call these stickers. It's kind of weird, but it is definitely metal. And, um, these clips, these hard clips, you know, you know how the hard clips go. It's, it's like a paper clip almost. These were, um, called I Heart Clips and they're $4 on sale for a dollar. These were on wings metal they call them metal stickers, $6 on sale for a dollar. They're super cute. And this busy little clip, the big clip, but they say busy, is so cute. Um, $2 on sale for a dollar. So I, I like, I really like that. And then these are um, just starstruck. They're just paper, thicker glitter paper sticker. They're just really, um, it's approximately 28 inches in length. So it's almost like a, a star, glitter star ribbon. I, I just thought it's it was cute. And um, I showed that slightly off the, the order. And then I got these. They're I'll, I'll tell you the price in a, in a second. Um, these are called Love Clips. They're paper clips, super cute. And um, they show like XOXO, the book with the heart on it, coffee cup with the heart on it, um, uh, letters with a camera and so forth, everything with a heart, even a ring. This one spell out the word love. This one, because they're, they spell out um, words, they're a little bit higher. They're $7 on sale for $3, but I loved it. Um, so I went ahead and grabbed one. And then I got these also. Um, these were called the Fam Bam. I don't know what that means. So I'm calling it the travel set. Now, these were not on these beautiful, you know, acrylic piece. They were just sold in, um, in like the, the buttons one. You know, they just threw them in here. These type of, um, the thing that wrapped around there, that's a bag. And, you know, so you can see what you got and everything falls to the bottom. I mean, the goal of your embellishment would be able to see them and also flatten them out, them out so they don't take as much space in whatever thing that you're storing them in. So I copied this design. I just took some thicker acrylic pieces that came with, I don't know, some stuff I bought. I, I save everything, guys. Um, and so I just, I think it came as eight and a half by 11. Actually, it came as like um, with a, um, um, what do you call those? The, the thing that companies sell you when you own their stock and then they send you send you that annual report. Um, I took it off the cover of an annual report. Um, so it was like eight and a half by 11. So I just cut it in half and clean up the borders and stuff and, um, you know, estimate the, the thing. And I just slit them and slide them in there. Isn't that such a great idea for storing these? So these were um, $7.00. The silver one was $7 on sale for a dollar. And I did the same thing. These are called cool cool tunes. So for music and stuff. And again, they came in a, in a baggie. Um, I put them like that. And then I'll label them later. But I thought that's really a nice way to. And they come with Apple um, music notes um, and glasses. I have no idea why glasses. And then these, by the way, was car, airplane, and a man and a woman like a bathroom a bathroom sign or something i don't know sort of strange okay and then the nuts so all of our metal is done um then i got these um stickers they're tiny little stickers you get two sheets but they're 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 cute they i think 
they come on paper or clear? I couldn't tell, but it's one is called Day Note and one is called Magical. They're sticky quotes. And um, so these were $4 initially and I got them for a dollar. I, th I thought they're good to use on scrapbook layout or cards or whatever. And then I got the the sticky, their file tab sticky notes. You get six color, 40 of each color. And they're $4 on sale for $2. I thought they'd be use, useful to even use on scrapbook layout, you know, when you want to make a tab for a um, a piece of whatever um, fem ephemera or, or a file folder that you make. And then I got these... Um, uh, what do you call it? They're de decorative strip in black. They have one in white as well, in, in red as well. And um, this was three dollars on sale for a dollar. You just get this one strip, and that's two of each color. Okay, so you get the the strip is half of that. And then I got this, which I I love. They're foil frames. A tiny frame. You can add a sentiment in the middle. You can do whatever. But I just wanted to try it out and and check it out. Two dollars on sale for a dollar. And then um, I got this really pretty um, Jane Davenport. You know her. Um, they're called colorist stickers, and I guess they they come with gold foil. Um, some is gold, some is silver, and so on. But they're so pretty. You can color on these or use them as is. Look at how how gorgeous is that, right? So they came with this sheet. They have two two of each sheet. So there's a gold one. There's a silver one. Look how gorgeous that that girl is, the mermaid girl. And then they had one in the um whatever you call it, purple kind of um, lavenderish foil, and then one in gold again. A beautiful thing, and these were originally $10. This whole stack for eight sheet is $2. So I love, love that. And then you got these stickers. I got these, I think these are com coming from one of their card kit. Um, back a little bit, and this was just called Sunshiny Day puffy stickers gorgeous four dollars on sale for two and these are just um foam stickers and they're just called be happy sentiment these were six dollars originally on sale for a dollar then i did not know i even bought two of these i thought i i bought usually one of everything because i don't know these company or anything but i'd probably just trigger finger and click it twice or whatever but these are called lovely words they're gold foil they're just like a thicker you know chipboard not chipboard exactly they're thinner than chipboard but thicker than cardstock and four dollars on sale for two dollars i mean on sale for a dollar um i boo let me see let me see i on sale for i'm sorry on sale for yeah, for a dollar, okay, a dollar each. So that's actually good. And these are like the shiny foil. Then you get these um, luminous alphabets, which is really cute. These are all fun stampers journey. Um, this is called luminous. This is called sunshine, and I I love these. These are puffy stickers, and this one is look like cardboard, um, chipboard. And um, these were both originally four dollars on sale for two dollars. Okay, then I got this on the road, they call on the road holiday clip. They're paper clip, but they have these cute, um, you know, stuff, whatever, puffy stickers on top of them. And they're, they're cute on the road, kind of Christmassy one. And this one is called Colorful Life. And this is not a sticker, it's just 3D, 3D stickers, I mean, not, not clips. And the, the clips are six dollars on sale for two and these were i actually couldn't find them because this one sold out but i believe it's probably around six dollars as well on sale for two dollars okay and then i got now i couldn't find what did i what did i do with that one that is so, so oh here's the star stuff was on sale for a dollar originally on uh originally price is four dollars okay so yeah that's all my sticker stuff that i got then I got this really cute, um, these are called, um, uh, they're, trans they're, they're acrylic pieces and they're trans transparent layers and they're called amazing layers. Um, 
and there oh gosh i don't know if you can see yeah you can kind of see on these on these white one i'm going to lay out a few so you can see them and they're really pretty you know they're um it's they come they come with a um protective sheets right underneath so before you use them you do have to uh, peel that off on the back but these are all um silver silver base you can put them on top of your photos um and things like that or do whatever you like i mean i i love these type of clear um layers or clear card i got a couple from bella boulevard one a while back from tuesday morning and one recently which i'm going to show um you later because it's um it's you know what i'm going to show you on this this side um because that's part of a haul that i'm going to show you but look how pretty i mean it's like it's it's gonna it's three by what do you call it three by uh four by six so it's like um oh that's two of them see as you can see oh so pretty and then this one just say you and me so you got uh, six, six, you got 13 of these for, for how much were these? These were $9 originally on sale for $2. That's like, I mean, I tell you, that was just so amazing. I couldn't, I couldn't believe my luck when I uh, found these. Now, I, I think I need to, because I didn't know how to tell you guys um, when these sales are going on. So I think I have to get pull out my instagram account which i have one but i don't really post anything on it i need to pull pull them out and just ask you guys to follow me or something so when there there's a sale going i can tell you about it and you can buy it before like uh, you know usually i don't do my video until i receive the product so you won't know about them until until then which is like totally sucky right so anyway so now i'm gonna go to um, the next stash, which is like all the um, washi stickers and everything else. Now, I have this one. It is so funny. I've never um, seen something like this. So there's three rolls in this one. It comes kind of stand up like this. And this really cute little packaging. It's called Colorful Friends. Again, all of these, all of these are from Fun Fun Stampers Journey. I don't know if that's part of Spellbinders or not. I don't believe so, but I have no idea. Maybe it is. Okay, but check this out. I've never seen anything like it. I bought it because I was just intrigued, um, and so on. Because they kind of show the pictures really really wasn't very easy to see but these come with three three rolls like this and they are five dollars originally now on sale for three dollars uh, two dollars and each roll is like one roll that was in here was just the faces and it, as you pull them out so they have a little arrow so that's where you you start to pull off the tape there i i mess up on this first one i didn't know i was just trying to cut the tape out or whatever and i mess it up but um i can i'm gonna fix it but basically that's what you get and then you it's like um it's like uh, those doll thingy you just put them together based on what you want them to wear they come with a top the girl can wear dresses or whatever and the boys can have pants on and things and they can be all different color but they're washi tape isn't that so neat i've never ever seen anything like that so i thought that that just gave me a, a a giggle you know because it's so funny um and so on and then this one um that was called colorful friends this one, i've never seen such a long washi that's different you know so basically everything you see the the uh, thing here the um uh, flowers here that's that's basically this whole thing is different so it say the thing you are the thing you never want live simply love generously learn constantly what a good saying good morning is a is a way of holding on to the things you love um this set is called farmer's market and i think it is sold out but nevertheless check it and see originally four dollars for these three and it's on sale for a dollar this one doesn't repeat that long that's where where it is it ends right here and then it starts again okay so that's very cute all the greens and it's here's all the vegetables and again this one start here and it ends right here so it's not like that one okay but it's so so pretty i love it so much um and then this one is another one that's super long too these are called girls life 
and this is how long it go it's it's go it start here and um it stop here that's the how long it is of all the different verbiage play hard live live in possibility love good things come to those who hustle and then work hard okay love it and then this one i i mess up and i ripped a little bit but this one is so cute too it's a cool ooh girl girl's life friday and then it repeats to with the cool and so it's really long too and then you get a um set of um uh, glitter pink glitter washi tape i love this same thing this was um, four dollars on sale for a dollar and um so on so love it that was such a good deal and then i got this one so i'm gonna borrow this one real quick and check it out here oops don't go away um this one is called holiday fun it is a big thicker but i i just liked it i thought it was super cute and it actually quite long as well see so oh and maybe this sheet is not big enough here, I do that on here. You see, so it goes, you can see, it start to repeat over here. And these, um, this one is $2 on sale, and it was originally uh, $3. So it wasn't a big sale since it's, it's you know, within season. So it's $120, not a dollar, an inch and 25 an inch, one and a quarter inches in width. And you can cut them out. You, that's what I thought. You know, I would do embellishment out of these, stick them on cardstock and cut them out and use them for a little cute little thing, whatever you wanted to do, or maybe a cute borders. So that's um, holiday fun. And then the last um, washi tape I have is a, is a thick one. Now I've gotten a few thicker ones. I haven't done anything with them, but my goal for a thick one is um and this one is super cute it's called sweet tape it's really it's the same design it's just pretty um and so on but what i was thinking of doing is again putting them on cardstock and use them to cut cute you know embellishment hearts whatever out of them instead of using them as is like this because um, the design is so cute and it's it's cheap. It's this is see how thick this was. This was originally oh well, this one was not too so so cheap, but anyway, this one was originally six seven dollars on sale for three. But I love the pattern. It has so many cute colors, and so um I went ahead and get that. Okay, and then yeah, and then I got ribbons. This cute ribbon was um, I don't know why they would be 10. It's 15 yards. That's why they're um, 15, no, $10, $11 and on sale for $2. I just like the color. I think they're sweet. They're easy. I think they're easy to use with a bunch of stuff, but 15 yards, you guys, that's a lot of yards. Okay, let's move this baby out of the way. And oops, uh oh, what did I drop? I want to make sure it wasn't something I was going to show you. Nope, that was fine. That's I already show you. And then we go into this trims. Now this I know was sold out because I tried to find the pictures for my receipt and I couldn't find it. Um, it's called Boho Trim. You get a yard of each and um, and there's five different one. And these were originally $5 on sale for a dollar. So you get this beautiful glitter thingy. You get this almost jute-like, but it's in a it's in a pattern kind of weaving it's really cute this cotton bit is super cute the leaves i love and this is a velvet pink ribbon okay so i thought that was really cute and then you get these cute little bows um what do you call that uh, um uh, little bows that remind me so much of the collection called uh, Buena Diaz from Obed Marshall that was introduced in uh, February of this year. He had a bunch of bow ties in there um, in terms of images, but these are really cute bows. It doesn't have to be a bow tie, you know, but these were $4 on sale for a dollar. These are paper, paper flower and they're really good flower and not as expensive as well they were what they were list price wise but on sale they were awesome and these were called cottage flowers and these were called meadow and four dollars originally on sale for a dollar so i picked one of each up and then i love these these were more similar to like um 
uh, Prima Flowers. Love these colors. They're flat, great to use on scrapbooking and so on. These are called Fresh Cuts. These are still available. Um, and then Vintage Bursts. And these have greenery as well and even wire, wire bits on these. Uh, this was on, both of these were $5 initially on sale for $2. So it's not as, yeah, it's, it's just about as good as, um, as uh, Hobby Lobby, which normally was on sale for, I think, a dollar uh, 49 or something, but I never was able to find anything at Hobby Lobby's with regards to flowers. So I figured I'd pick these up because I really like those color as well. Um, okay, let's see. And then I got some sequins that were, I've never tried their sequins. So since on, they're on sale, I figure I, I get some to, to look at. They were all $5.95 per jar. And um, these are called Confetti Sparkle Element. One is Clear clear Sparkle, one is Candy Apple, and then one is called Lemon Grass. And they're really pretty. They're on sale uh, from $5.95 to $1. Okay, gorgeous. And they're, I kind of like it because, you know, can you see? They're hexagon shape. So it's it's different than just a, like a circle. I just thought they, they were interesting. And this have a hint of... Um, pink in it so even though it's a clear sparkle it's you know as you move it has pink which you know what you know it already pink is my fave so there you go okay um let's see and then what do i do next i got those stickers i did those boy I'm like so organized it's ridiculous let's see okay so now we go to stamps I got a few um, stamps and a bunch of dies. So let me show you what I got. Oh, heavy, heavy on some of these. Okay, so um, I really do not care for um, thick stamps. You know, the one that used to come on a wooden, wooden big thingy, which I have a tons of that I don't use at all. Um, but these are, they took out the, 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 the wooden ones, so you can still use these with your stamping stamping uh, helper unit, whatever you call them, uh, like the Misty. And um, and they print really nice, you know, on the stamp so you know exactly what it is. And with the Fun Stammer Journey, I love this because this should be going on to, you know, like a, a acrylic type thing. And so they made their... Um, the, the thing that you have in the front of the card is like almost like a credit card feel and it is gorgeous gorgeous all three of these which are the red rubber stamp which by the way t stamp much better than clear um poly po uh, photo polymer stamps um they stamp really nice these they're just great so anyway i'm gonna i can't wait to try that so this one is called um hey girl and how cute look how cute that is right so so sweet it's nine dollars initially on sale for three this was kind of a little bit high i thought these were a little bit bigger but that's okay because i scanned that in and i can always enlarge it if i just wanted to use it, print it out on a piece of paper, color it and use it for my scrapbooking instead of stamping because if I want something bigger than that, right? You already purchased it. So if you want to manipulate it to use for your own projects, you can do that. Um, then this one is called um, Mistletoe and Holly. Come just right, you know, right in, in sentiment. I got these because I was thinking of my friend Joyce, but look how pretty these are. You can Put them together and make a wreath out of them if you want to stamp it that way and so on um and so these got 14 stamps and it's originally um list for 20 dollars on sale for five so they're not super cheap stuff but i think i just think they were sweet this one i absolutely love because i love camera and it's called beautiful moments uh, 19 originally now three dollars and they're just solid one you can print them in different colors um and the bit in in the middle and stuff like that i just thought they were very very pretty could be done with for fun sentiment i um, mean um embellishment and stuff and then this one <laughs> is is so cool it's called cool beans these were from spell binders so they they say the words and these are also the red um rubber stamp they holy guacamole let's give them something to talk about and then they come with 
the cute little die that you can die cut the uh, taco and so on. And then I'm not sure what this is. Um, but in any case, I will play with that and see. And these were $15 originally on sale for a dollar. So that was a really good deal, I thought. And um, then I have, um, let's see. Let's see what's next. Uh, uh -huh. I don't know why I don't have these. Let's see, let's see. Because I thought I did all of those together. Maybe I got rid of them and I forgot to put them back in. Yep, I did. Oh, no, I did. Okay, and then these are called um, Built built a Sentiment Stamps from Spellbinders. These were originally 13, I mean, um, $13 on sale for five. And I really like this, you know, because you can go happy birthday, happy anniversary, happy Father's Day, and just build them up. And they're small enough, but they're big enough too. So um, I just thought they're they're really good. And these are the uh, photopolymer stamp. So they're much better than acrylic stamp, but not as good as the rubber stamp. Okay, so just in case you don't know. And then I also got this really cute um, Mermaid Tails from Jane Davenport and you can make a little um they stamps and come with the coordinating die you can make uh, shaker cards out of this if you like but I I thought these would be a little bit bigger but it's okay these would make good embellishment on something smaller instead of making like a huge card out of it um and her dies is so cool it comes in that beautiful teal turquoise color um then I got this one that is kind of interesting I don't exactly know what it looks like um the, the, i look at the picture and i can't tell either i guess it come it become like this i don't know it doesn't anyway um i have to make it and see but these are um they're called they're called um petite double bow okay petite double bow with dimensional circle and these were a dollar on sale from 15 now who pays 15 for that i don't know but nevertheless that was how they list price now i did buy a glimmer hot foil plate that say congratulations now, i don't have a hot foil system yet um but and i think i actually made a mistake i thought this was just a regular die but nevertheless i do plan to get it eventually and um so i don't mind having a few of these initially especially with word sentiment that is very easy to use okay then i got this one called rebel skull now is that scary or what you know supposedly they have a skull right there it's a it's a skull it's like a banner you know banner thingy and it's a rebel skull banner um with a crown separately as well and these were 23 dollars initially on sale for five so I, I was thinking halloween maybe or something like that that could be cool i actually just got commissioned to do um a um a 50th birthday cards for um the wife of one of my clients and it's her birthday is in early november and she loved goth so you know maybe that would be a great banner sentiment to do her 50th birthday thing on um okay then i got this cute they call it kaleidoscope uh kaleidoscope snowflake and the reason i got it it's kind of cool i don't know exactly what these things are I, you know with the picture i couldn't tell either um but you layer them you lay them on top of each other so the dye the snow i have plenty of snowflake dye but these are exactly the same and you just lay them on top of each other this was part of the small dye of the month for their club um back in november a couple years ago so i just liked it these were on sale for ten dollars so they're no i'm sorry yeah, $10 from $22, which was outrageous. But $10 is a little high still. But anyway, I figured I'd try it and see. And then this one is called Cinch and Go Flowers number three. And the same thing. You get basically four of the same flower in nesting size and leaves and so on. But supposedly you make these gorgeous. You can make these gorgeous flowers, dimensional flowers and so on. Again, this is from... By the way, this is from um, uh, Becca Feekin. She's a really good designer for spell binders, and twenty-two dollars on sale for ten. 
Um, those are some of my expensive ones. Then this one I thought was super cute. It's called Away We Go. And it's just made, you know, no embossing, nothing. It's just a die that just have kits. And so it'd be make a great um, embellishment for pages that you talk about siblings or friends or cards that, that deal with the same matter. Normally 18 on sale for five. And then I'm going to put two of them together. So that way I don't have to reach down every time. Uh, this one is called Botanical House. I just love that. I just thought that was so cute. They have a bunch of little leaves and so on with it. And that's what you make. And so I just thought that was so cute. Um, these were, let's see how much these were. These were $25 on sale for $10. Then I have this, um, um, they call them Eloquent Twist Square. These were also from um, Becca Ficken, uh collection. And I just like the way I saw the photos on the website. I just like the way I don't have, I have plenty of square dies, square frame dies, but I don't have this particular um, looking thingy. And I just thought they're so cute. And they are very um, thin in terms of, they're very delicate looking. I, I just love that look. Um, so anyway, I got that. $25 on sale for 10 So I got a bunch of $10 ones, which now looking back, I'm like, why, Rose? Why? Um, <laughs> then I've got this one. This one is cute, and it's just right at the season. This was their die of the month back in October, two years ago, the large die kit of the month. And their list price was $35. I got it for 15 but look how much you got. You got like 17 dies, all these leafy bit that you can make a wreath with. You have a cute pumpkin. You have a cute little label. Um, so, you know, so these are some of the things you can you can have. Like, do you see how it's swagging down and so forth? I just thought it's super pretty. And it's called um, uh, Fall Flora. Okay, so that's that one. And then I got the, um, this one is called Oval coronet don't know what that means um but it's really it looks really pretty this was their small die of the month uh back in november of uh, 2019 22 dollars on sale for five and it's just very you see it's very delicate uh frame and background that you can do stuff with i just thought it was uh, beautiful and then this one is called rosa Di diamante diamante is how you say it and again, it's it's just pretty. It's just a nice, pretty background. They were five dollars from twenty five dollars. So I thought I'd pick it up, and it comes with the layering shadow die and everything else. Okay, so you could do you could do um, a shake of cards with that if you like. All right, and then these two, these last two from Spellbinders is let me see where the sheets are um this one is called ornamental valance and this one is called annabelle trousseau laying layering and it comes with quite a bit of stuff these are both from becca Fekins, and they're originally priced 27 dollars for each of them this one's on sale for five this one's on sale for ten and i just think they're beautiful i mean it's you know, they're just background and sometimes you just need a pretty background to go to go even on your it doesn't have to be a card. I think it can go definitely be used on scrapbooking as well. Look how pretty this is. This remind me of a Anna Griffin die I have, but doesn't matter. It's different enough. Um and look at this cute little scroll and even that cute little banner thing that you can use. So lots of die for that price. Okay. And then all the left, the rest of the dies are from uh, Fun Stamper Journey. So I got these one that's called Artful Butterfly. Super cute. Again, they, they come with the layering die as well, but these are exactly the same. Um, uh, that's what I've been trying to build up. I don't have a lot of those. Is So you can layer them on top of each other and make a super cool three-dimensional, doesn't show, um, three-dimensional butterfly. 
And then these are Journey Blooms Holiday Set. It has some, some um, Halloween stuff and some Christmas stuff, which I thought was super cute. These just come in, um, this just like, it's it's not on a, on a card or anything. They just come like that, but they're large, nice and big. And I love that they're, look at that green. Oh my God, how cute is that, right? So it's it's kind of cool, and I'll show you the butterfly real quick in case you want the size. But I believe on online they have all the sizes. That's why I wasn't too worried about showing you um, the size. But look how how huge this one is, you know. But you can layer that like that, and then you can layer that like that. But these are the these are very nice size to use. Then here's the the shadow die on that. Okay, so let me put these back before I lose like a piece or something. Usually I don't care to put them back, but this one, especially this one, I think I better before things just gonna fall apart. And then I got also a um, cute little congrats die, which I make graduation custom graduation cards um, for um, for clients a lot. So. I thought another congrats die is not a bad thing to have. And it's just, it's just like that. It's a banner thingy. And that was, um, oh, by the way, both of the, the one I just showed was originally 15 for the butterfly, 25 for this one. And they're both on sale for $5. The congrats, congrats die is a dollar, originally six. And then I got the clouds die. These are all nesting dies on the clouds. And these were 25 originally on sale for $5. I just love that. I think, you know, doing um, cards or, or pages with cloud shapes kind of behind sometime is really cute. You can do, you can um, use your oxide, um, distress oxide of ink or whatever, and just kind of color them in if you want to. Um, also, I got this star one. Um, I, I actually have something, but I think it's not as large. But these gives you five, six pieces. And again, they were a really good price. This, both of these were originally $25 on sale for $5. And this one's on sale for just $3. Um, so that's amazing. Okay. And then I got this one and this one. As I mentioned, I don't have a lot of banner dies. This is a reverse banner dies, and this is just a rectangle banner die, a pendant, 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 yep. Um, both of these are originally 25 on sale for, this one is $3, this one is $5, because this one have 11 die. Isn't that awesome? I love that, love, love. Um, very, very good. Okay, and then I got, I'm so sorry, it's a bit long, but this I love. I think this is gonna be super cute. This one is a, a cut and emboss, um, embossing folder in a five by seven size, and same with this. And this one, can you see? It's almost like a, almost like a fan. It is a fan, and this is just a a kind of a diamond background. It's really really pretty, um, and so on. So these were. Um, these were originally $13 on sale for $3. So I thought they, that's just, you see, you can, can you see it a little bit better here on this side and so on. So I'm going to make some, some stuff out of this one. Definitely going to be more like a card. I'll make some and I'll share that later. Okay. Um, I was trying to see if I can cut these out for you, but then <laughs> that would then take me forever to, um, get this, this, um, this video app okay then i got some steel rule dies so you know how expensive steel rule die is but the reason i got it and i don't even know if i have the right cutting machine to use it because i have i bought a big shot but my big shot is a regular big shot it's not the big shot plus so it may be too small this i know for sure would cut but the reason i got these were you know again these are um uh, banner dies and these will cut through anything unlike your thin lid um, dies these will cut through any kind of material even chipboard so I thought this would be a good a good thing to have to try it out and then they're, they're not huge but they're really good size so um, I got that one and these were um, oh, steel dies are really expensive you guys these were originally $22 and on sale for $5 and then I got this one, which is like a, a more of a little tag. And you can see the size better here, maybe, uh, if you can see it. But it comes with a cute 
I like this for tag. It comes with that one and this one. And again, they're the same price as the other one, I believe. It's originally 22 on sale for five, okay? And these are all um, Spellbinder. They're, they think they come from a company named Contour um, originally. Oh, look at my hair. I'm falling out of hair. Now this, I don't know if it's gonna fit. I don't think this is gonna fit on my Big Shot. Um, so I may have to like borrow somebody Big Shot or or if I know somebody close by or um, have to upgrade to Big Shot Plus even though I just bought the Big Shot. Anyway, um, this one is a, a little uh, baggy. It's called a Lofty Pouch. And it's just cut everything like that. And then it makes a bags like that. You can decorate it, do whatever. The size of the bag that comes out is only um, three by four, a little bit over four. So it's like this big and maybe that big on high. So it's not huge, but it's super cute. And again, I love the fact that you can cut any material out of this. So hopefully I will be able to cut this out, but we'll see both of them. Two of the one I bought are these big size. Oh, but this one though, have the no the, the this one comes in one size but this one comes separately so these i know for sure i can cut out so this one is 60 dollars originally on sale for 10 dollars. like i told you these steel dies are very very expensive and same thing with these these are called heartfelt and they're just different shape of hearts and they can cut fabric they can cut i mean your cricket can do that too but um i just wanted these dies they're on sale for ten dollars originally sixty dollars and they have all these shapes of the hearts okay and so that and then i got a the last few things nope not quite the last few things let me show uh, i gotta move this one Okay, and then before I show you these, I'm gonna show you a bunch of things I got from um, Jane Davenport. So Jane Davenport, I got a few things from Michaels when they were, um, you know, kind of discontinued this whole line, but I didn't get this. This is called this one is called Wonder Wonderland Collection Story Time, and they're just paint pens. And um, I haven't bust them out or use them or anything, but. They were just such a good price, and I just, I really like her style. I have some of, a few of her books. Um, this was originally $40 on sale for $5. And then she got a couple of these, um, um, they're called uh, Shimmer Pastel. They're pastel. I have some pastel. Um, they're almost like chalk. And she had them already in a palette, and they're shimmer. So it's, you can see the shimmering is really prettiest part of her I think her mermaid collection but anyway they look like uh, eyeshadow I bet you you can use them as eyeshadow um, as well as this one is a is the chill uh, palette and the smaller one was list price for 14 on sale for two dollars this one was list price for twenty dollars on sale for three dollars and these were not shimmer okay but this one has a lot of colors so I just thought it's so reasonable and so cool um, and my my pastel um, that I got was so old that I probably could donate that or or um, do something else with it instead of using it as that. And I'll use these when I start doing that stuff again. Um, then I got these very pretty um, velvet pastel. I don't even know what they are exactly, but I think they're just so pretty. This is called Make It Rain. <laughs> so cute. They're called Velvet Pastel. Um, matte Gel. Okay, so matte gel pastel, don't know, don't know exactly. So I have to research that. She has a wonderful website that has a lot of information or I can also call them. Um, this one is, is called, um, what was that thing called? It's called Mo Monarch, Monarch. And then this one is called Pink Princess. Oh my gosh, my foot is killing me. I don't know why, all of a sudden. Um, so these were super cute. They were originally $8 on sale for a dollar. Then I bought the these um super pretty acrylic paint um one is is called uh, look at me lilac and one is called i love you pink and they're just um matte acrylic paint but look at the bottle how cute is that right there was oops sorry sorry about that i just hit the thing with my big head again uh, originally they're seven dollars on sale for two dollars so that's the only two colors they had um and so on and then they had this one, which is a uh, 
matte finish acrylic paint used mainly for faces i guess but they have the a whole set that has this kind of pretty uh, peach color and then some lightning thing or whatever they call matchmaker and originally these were twenty dollars on sale for three dollars so i really like this one and if i can't use those because one of them seems like it's kind of leaked out or dry or something but we'll see and but i don't care that's that one is good enough for me and then I got this fun, I just think it's cute. So I don't know, I mean, they're brush set, you know, they're called mermaid um, brush set. You have that to cover this thing. And they're just cute. They're gold and everything on sale for $5 from $27. So I got that. And then I got this really cool organizer. I don't know if you can kind of see it, but it's like that. Okay, it has a beautiful side that look like that. And you can put some of your paint here, some of the one we got, you know, some, some foam thingy there and so on. I just thought it's so cute. And it's, you know, you can use it for anything, I guess. Um, but I thought it's really pretty and it's in black. Although a lot of my thing in my craft room is white, uh, whatever. Um, no biggie. Okay, so that's that. And then the last few thing I got is I got, now I have a, a brayer. But I have a um, a hard brayer, so I needed a soft brayer because I I know that for some of the things we need to do, I need a soft brayer. So I got that for it's in really originally for twelve dollars. It's on sale for three. I got the um, I don't know exactly what this is. It say it's a blender collection. I mean a, bl a fusion blender you use with the fusion re-inkers add blending solution to your blending brush to pick up colors and apply to your stamp image okay there you go um so we'll see if i know what to do with that and then i got these fun party poppers i don't know what i'm gonna do with it but i just you know for the for my my for my girl when she does her parties i i pick up a couple of these they were on sale for a dollar from five dollars um and then um let's see okay and then I got this really pretty, um, they come in this bag, and but it's it's like like this. I, I bought a couple. They're really pretty cuff bracelet. I say, make dreams happen. And um, they're nice, dirty. You can squeeze them up, you know, squeeze them together, kind of. They're super hard. Um, but uh, I think they're really gorgeous. So I got that, and normally they're $22. I got it for five dollars. I bought two. I bought I bought another one, but they were out, so they refund my money for that, which was a little sad. Um, and then I got a card kit. I've always wanted to know what's in their card kit. I never. I didn't want to spend that kind of money because the card kit was originally fifty five dollars. I don't know. I think when you join the club, it's cheaper. But still, it just seems really high. So I just want, since it's on sale, I like this one the best. So I bought that one for $25 just to check it out. But before that, I'm going to show you um, the, uh, this I thought was an excellent deal. I, I don't know anything about this. Again, the company and the paper. But this one is called Celebrate You. I figure I can, I love these, um, I love the, um, whatchamacallit, the, I'm going to squeeze it in. Um these paper images and the color and everything else. So I figure I can always use this, doesn't matter, but it was um, on sale for $5, originally $17. Okay, so this, I'll show you this first, but look how pretty, right? And the paper is nice and thick. It is double-sided. So you get you get quite a, quite a bit, say hip hip hooray. And you get four, let me see, you get four sheets for each, design so you get um six six design four sheets you get 24 sheets look how cute these little tassel thing is there you go right the color got some teal in it some really pretty color and then the stars and the confettis and all that good stuff then some banner pages that's very celebratory i love it i birthday we always can use these could make really nice and some arrows which i love 
Hi, Karen. Karen, my friend from Yes, Please Paper Craft. She does not like arrows, but I love it. And then we got some suckers. What do you call these? Suckers? I don't know. Um, candy suckers. <laughs> suck, a, suck on a stick. Whatever you call them. They're cute. They're just a lot of cute little things. This is, I don't know why. This sort of make me feel like they should be part of the cheer collection, which I do have some. So maybe if I don't use this page, I may put that in there. But I don't know. I, I probably will use this one a lot more. I love this one. This one got make have a feel of polka dots, which I love. Polka dots on polka dots on balloons. Perfect, perfect um, thing. And then look how pretty this backside is. I love it so much. And then this one has... Oh my God, reach for the star, whatever it takes. You're an inspiration. Set your goal. Celebrate the milestone. Looking great. Believe and achieve. Da, da, da. No pain, no gain. Attitude is everything. Got a lot of very cool um, inspirational uh, verbiage. And then the winning ribbon thingy in the back. Okay. So I love the colors. I love the thing. And I thought it was an amazing uh, price for that. So the last thing I got was the card kit, as I mentioned. So let's open it together and see what I get in here. And let's see if it's worth the money, even the discounted money, right? So I'm going to pull this out so I can see it a little bit better. Okay. So this kit is called Around the World because I like to travel. We travel a lot. So I always have travel um, paper to, uh, to go with. So this have a... A sheet that tells you exactly what it comes in this is the date of the card kit but that's nice and a few samples of things and then that um, also show you how to put a card together I guess if you don't know how um, they came with these it seems like their watercolor their watercolor uh, paper because it's um, it's sort of texture and it's just the, the A4 cards which I, I a2 cards which i don't use a lot that's mean that they're four and a quarter yeah four and a quarter by five and a half um but it doesn't matter i can always use that for something else and so you get 10 of, of each of these you get this cute paper pack that's a six by six that's why they do a2 because um a2 cards because the six by six paper pad works well for that and so this is their paper pad. It's called Around the World. Now these paper are relatively thin. It's not super, super thin, but it's thin. And I believe, it doesn't say, but let's check. I believe you probably get two of each. Yep, you get two of each kind. So that, and they're just single-sided. So I'm going to show you real quick what they look like. That's that's really pretty though, huh? The, the With the uh, coral airplane. Let's peach color squid some verbiage thing some pink this like look like that uh, board at the airport so this i can combine it with um oh what fun collection or just plain fun uh, oh what fun is from pink fresh studio oh um fun what is it just plain fun is from um fancy pants but look how pretty these tags are this would have been excellent on a 12 by 12 because these tags are way too small to use, really. Except you're doing it with a cluster embellishment or something. And then that. And some street paper. Some of the... Oh, I remember. Geotags. Geotags. I still don't know what they do exactly. I didn't, I didn't look them up. But they're geotags. Whatever. And not my favorite thing. But I can always trim them down use them as circle. Then the Eiffel Tower background page, my beautiful pink leopard, just some bunch of da da da, <laughs> some cute stripes, some tropical leaves. So they have, it's kind of have a bunch of different theme to it just because it's just travel in general, not like summer tropical travel, or whatever. Beautiful foil page with the cameras. And then the map. And some more tropical stuff. And then it's back to the beginning. Okay, so you get that with the envelope. I'll just do the paper. I should have opened it ahead of time. They give you some cardstock and just one each. That, the gold foil, 
some white, some pink, and some light green. I guess it, it would match whatever you, um, you use there, okay? And then you get some thick foam dots, which is great. Some um, double-sided tape, so they give you everything you need. These are cute little pink sequins. They give you some dyes of the globe, which is awesome. So I don't have that. I don't have anything, any dyes with globes at all. And then you get, so you get the base of the globe here, kind of like for that. You can create the globe, with, you know, like this, right? It holds like that, I guess, or something like that. And then you have this. So uh, layers, you can do, you can do um, shaker cards if you want to. And then that's the base of the globe thingy, right? So cool on that one. And then you get these cute butterfly three-dimensional stickers. Gorgeous here. You get these um, stamps. It's got, what is that? Hop. Drop in any mail, huh? I don't know what that is. Um, just some words and whatever that thing is and some numbers and things. This looks really very nice. Actually, there, I'm sure there are photopolymer stamps. You got this set of uh, puffy stickers that's on both sides. Very pretty. Oh, I like these. Very, very nice. And then the last thing is this set of uh, die cut shapes, which I apologize, I should have opened it up earlier and um, pulled these out for you, but I'll throw a few out. And if you need me to do that, just let me know and I'll put it on a next one of my next um, crafty haul or something. If you wanted to see it, then and I'll send you a notice so you'll you'll know to go look at that. But it seems like you get two of each kind some so some airplane some luggage really nice some what do you call that um uh caps some more of that some tags some books some bicycle very cute some cameras some boats cute butterflies some foil words yeah very very um nice ephemera not too big uh, look at that the airplane you know the the airplane windows and the bus and the cute little um, umbrella at the beach. Some, even the radio, some buildings. You see how cute the buildings are? Look at that. You can set up a whole thing. I guess these are like keychain or something. And then the Eiffel Tower even. Oh my gosh, this is so awesome. You get, it doesn't tell you how much, how many pieces you get, but you get some cute ones. I love that. Really nice. I'm happy. I'm happy with this kit at the half price. The $55, $25 from $55. But the, if it was full price, whatever the full price was, I don't think I would be very happy. I don't know. We'll see. Um, thank you so much for joining me. So go, go take a look at, um, oopsie, go take a look at Spellbinders website and check out under the clearance section under sales and all the clearance you should be able to see some of these still and um, still quite a few good deals as, as far as when I checked this morning all right and I actually may come in and <laughs> buy a few more things for myself um, now that I see what they look like I actually could see using more of certain things I mean I left I took out a lot of things I actually put in Quite a few more things on my cart but at the end it was so high i mean even with this i spent quite a bit um that day so i really didn't want more but now that you know now that i see some of the things i get i may go back in there and take a quick look to see if they've added something new as well as see some of the things that i kind of put back see if i still want them okay because some of the things i put back was the higher price item all right here's my oh and there's here's my geotag Whatever that is, again, let's see by the time, next time I do a crafty haul, if I find out what that is, all right? All right, you guys, thank you so much for joining me. I will talk to you real soon. Bye.